Introduction to Working with OCIDs, API, and SSH keys in Oracle Cloud Infrastructure. Hi! As I explore the various IaaS services, I see that most application installations have certain prerequisites like SSH key pair, API fingerprint. I need to enter tenancy details at other times. Can you help me find out where to look for these details? Sure. I can show you how to locate the tenancy details. As for the SSH key pairs and API fingerprints, these will need to be generated. It is a simple process, and I can walk you through the steps. Open the User menu and click User Login ID. The user, OCID, is shown under User Information. The API fingerprint is displayed on the same page under the API Keys section. To get the Tenancy OCID, open the User menu and click Tenancy, indicating your tenancy name. The Tenancy OCID is shown under Tenancy Information. Instances use an SSH key pair instead of a password to authenticate a remote user. A key pair file contains a private key and public key. You keep the private key on your computer and provide the public key every time you launch an instance. How does one create the key pairs? Let's begin by examining the components first. The command arguments for generating the SSH key pair are shown in the table. To create key pairs, you can use a third-party tool, such as OpenSSH, on Unix-style systems, including Linux, Solaris, BSD, and OSX. Putty, key generator on Windows or Git Bash. We will proceed with Git Bash. To generate the SSH key pair, enter command. Enter the file name for the key pair. Enter the passphrase if you want to protect the key. For the purpose of this demo, we are not using a passphrase. To see the newly created RSA private key, enter command. To see the newly generated RSA public key, enter command. To generate the API key, create a directory called API key using the command. Generate the private key using the command. For the sake of this demo, we are creating the key without the passphrase. Ensure that only you can read the private key file by using the command. Use the following command to create the public key. Use the following command to view the public key. You can get the key's fingerprint with the following OpenSSL command. Now, log in to the OCI environment. Click the username. On the User Details page, click the Add Public Key button. Copy the generated public key and paste the public key in the box. Click Add. Once the key is uploaded, the fingerprint is generated in the console. You can see the fingerprint listed under API Keys on the User Details page. Now, compare it with the fingerprint generated in the Git Bash window. Great! I can easily locate user details and enable access control with SSH and API Keys for my instances. Thanks for the walkthrough! You're welcome!
Please go to the Oracle Cloud Infrastructure Portal to learn more. Be sure to sign up for the free trial and get started right away.